And remember, last time we derived the vorticity transport equation for a fully compressible fluid with variable density. This was a very general form we looked at, um, accumulation, advection, vortex stretching um, due to velocity gradients, due to dilatation, baroclinic term due to um, pressure and density um, uh, differences, and diffusion of vorticity and body forces. Now we're going to specialize this equation to the following. We're going to use um, constant density flow. So this means rho equal constant everywhere and therefore div u is equal to zero. And also we're going to specialize this to 2d. What this means is well, the first two terms remain the same, okay? And omega, this implies that omega becomes a scalar, like in um, 2D Cartesian becomes omega z. Okay, so we're gonna replace things um, accordingly. So we will have d omega by dt plus u dot grad omega equals to, now think about this term. In 2D, I'll give you an example. Um, omega dot nabla u in 2D is equal to zero in 2D. Think about this term. Omega has, for example, the following components for Cartesian, and nabla u is only um, d by dx and d by dy and zero, and so their dot product is going to be identically zero. So um, we drop that term, so we have a uh, nothing over here, and this guy is zero by virtue of div u equals zero. Now that guy, grad rho, is zero because um, rho is constant. Um, for this guy, we're gonna assume that mu is constant as well, so we get mu over rho, or nu, curl of del squared u, which is um, uh, del squared omega, okay? So this term is del, nu del squared omega, because you can take the curl in. And we will assume um, uh, conservative body forces. So this means that B is some grad phi, and therefore curl B is equal to zero. Okay, so let me add this assumption over here. Conservative body forces. Okay, so with those assumptions then the vorticity transport equation reduces simply to d omega by dt which is equal to d omega, partial omega by partial t plus u dot grad omega and that's equal to nu del squared omega. Pretty neat and uh, beautiful and simple equation. Let's uh, draw a rectangle around that. Okay, and that's the vorticity transport equation in for vorticity vorticity transport equation in two D for constant density flow and constant properties.